Hey guys, uh, today I'm gonna show you how to wire a sump pump system. This is made for uh, draining uh, like rain water if you, you have a spot that accumulates water. Let's take a look. So this property has two of them. This is what you call a backup and this is the, the primer. So when the primer is uh, to capacity or it has a malfunction, this, this guy will take over. So to go real quick, you have two pumps, one leading, one lagging, and you have four sensors. Those are floats, the water will, when rising will trigger them. And right there we have a control panel for both of them. Each one has one. So I just wired these guys. The wires were pulled, but the the connections were not made. So they called me to to make the connection. So I'm gonna uh, go over. So this is pump one, and this is pump two. They when they are in they are in operation, they will alternate. So they don't one doesn't get used too much. And uh, those are the the floats. Basically, we have alarm lag lead and stop stop is all the way on the bottom when the water level reaches all the way to the bottom it will uh, stop the pump a lead will uh, if your f uh, this float is uh, activated and then the second float from the bottom is activated that will trigger the uh, one of the pumps uh, which is on a lead uh, to turn on the lag will help if uh, the sensor reaches to the second level and then uh, if it, the water reaches all the way to the top, uh, you will have an alarm, which will be like something like this. So the alarm is functioning. And uh, here, if we press the stop and the lead test, one of the contactor, which is the one to the right, is activated. And to show that they alternate, we're gonna press it again and see if it's gonna switch. And now it's the other one is activated. So basically this is how it works. And we have another guy here, same. Well, I'm gonna turn it on and uh, again, uh, check the, we're gonna put it on auto for the pump one and pump two, and then check the alarm. Alarm is working. Now do the stop and this. And the left one is activated. Do it again. The right one is activated. So pretty much that is it. And that's how that system works. Now the challenge here is to put this thing down. This thing weighs like 200 pounds. I don't know if they really have to have it this heavy. I don't think there is any traffic here, but it is what it is. Thanks. Thanks for watching.